welcome to this important lesson if you think that you are in problem to convert 160 cm in feet or if you think that you want to learn how to convert centimeter centimeter in feet then you have come to the right place today i am going to share you show you three methods to convert from centimeter in feet step by step look at here to convert centimeter to feet you have to uh, know the basic equivalence between centimeter and feet but unfortunately <coughs> there is no basic relationship between direct basic relationship between centimeter and feet but with centimeter we have the relationship of inch that is 1 inch 1 inch equal to 2.54 centimeter that is we have the relationship centimeter with inch and with inch we have the relationship of feet that is 1 feet equal to 12 inches, right? We'll use these two, uh, uh, two basic equivalents. Okay, let me show you how to uh, remember this basic equivalence, right? Okay, let me delete this uh, first. Okay, look at here. You, we, know, we know that yard is greater than feet, right? Yard is greater than feet and feet is greater than inch and inch is greater than centimeter. Look at here. Again, yard is greater than feet, feet is greater than inch and inch is greater than centimeter. You know that one yard equal to three feet and then one feet equal to 12 inch. And then one inch equal to 2.54 centimeter, right? On the other hand, if you want to come this way, then you have to remember that centimeter to inch, that is one centimeter equal to one by 2.54 inch, and one inch equal to uh, 1 by 12 feet and 1 feet equal to 1 by 3 yard. Look at here. I have taken here 3, 12, 2.5 foot. Then I am just taking inverse of this. 2.5 foot. The inverse of 2.5 foot is 1 by 2.5 foot. Then I am taking here 12. Then I am taking here 1 by 12. That is opposite of it. Inverse of it. And then I am taking inverse of 3, 1 by 3, right? I think this is very easy. Look at here. If you want to convert yard to feet, then you have to multiply by 3. And then if you want to convert feet to inch, then you have to multiply by uh, 12. And if you want to convert inch to centimeter, then you have to multiply by 2.54. And even if you want to convert centimeter to inch, then you have to multiply by 1 by 2.54. Then if you want to convert inch to feet, then you have to multiply by 12, uh, 1 by 12, right? And if you want to convert feet to yard, then you have to multiply by 1 by 3, right? So let me show everything in here. If I want to convert 160 centimeter to feet, then what will I do? Okay, look at here. I, I would like to convert. I would like to convert here centimeter to feet. So, locate centimeter in this diagram. So, you would like to convert this centimeter to feet. So, at first we have to convert centimeter to inch. And to convert centimeter to inch, you have to multiply by 2.54. So let me do this. So 160 times 1 by 2.54. So this you got this inch, right? And 160, so centimeter to inch. We have converted to inch. Then we have to convert it, this inch to feet. That is, to convert inch to feet, we have to multiply by 1 by 12. So, look at here. 160 
times 1 by 2.54 times 1 by 12 1 by 12 feet right look at here at first we are going to centimeter to inch by uh, multiply by multiplied 1 by 2.54 right and then we are good going to uh, inch to feet by multiplying 1 by 12 by multiplying 1 by 12 feet right now let me use my calculator right 160 times 1 by 12 so I have to uh, I have to divide this 160 by this and this so let me divide 160 divide 2.54 2.54 that gives me this now we have to divide this by 12 so divide by 12 so we are getting 5.24 5.249 if I take three digit right then nine feet that is 160 centimeter equal to 5.25 feet if I round it to two digit then I will get 160 centimeter equal to 5.25 feet okay this is the first way right by using diagram by using this diagram i can easily convert 160 centimeter to feet okay let me show the second way to convert centimeter to feet right so let me uh, delete this at first okay now let me show you the second way right second way in second way what will i do I will just rewrite this 160 centimeter right I can write 160 times 1 centimeter I am just rewriting this now I'll put value of this 1 centimeter right so how how I will get the value of 1 centimeter I have to search for the basic relationship between centimeter and feet but unfortunately there is no basic relationship from between uh, centimeter and feet so I will write here uh, 1 inch equal to 2.54 centimeter from this thing what I'll do 1 inch divided by 2.54 equal to 1 centimeter right from this we we are getting this okay so let me put the value of 1 centimeter here 160 times 1 inch divided by 2.54 right i can rewrite this right 160 times 1 inch times 1 by 2.54 so now i will put the value of one inch right so what okay we know that we know that we have relationship between inch and feet we know that one feet equal to 12 inch right so i can rewrite this one feet equal to 12 times 1 inch right i am just rewriting this and then we are getting here 1 feet divided by 12 equal to 1 inch so i have to put value of 1 inch from here so look at here 160 times the value of 1 inch here 1 feet divided by 12 times 1 by 2.54 
that is we are getting 160 times 1 by 2.54 times 1 feet by 12 so if you divide this 160 by 2.54 and 12 then you are getting this result 5.249 that is 5.25 5.25 by rounding right this fit so look at here this is the second way to convert 160 centimeter in feet here i am just rewriting this 160 centimeter like this then i am going to put the value of one centimeter from the basic equivalence between centimeter in inch and right and when i will be able to convert it to inch then i have to put the value of inch with feet right so from this relationship we are getting 1 inch equal to 1 feet by 12 so I am just putting here and then I am calculating okay now I will go to the third method so let me delete this at first our third method is consist of uh, uh, three step right in the first step what I will do in the first step what I will do I will just write the basic relationship between centimeter and feet but unfortunately there is no basic relationship between centimeter and feet but with centimeter we have the relationship with of inch that is one inch equal to 2.54 centimeter and with inch we have the relationship of feet that is one feet equal to uh, 12 inch right in the second step what will i do second step uh, will write the conversion factor remember conversion factor is always equal to one you don't need to uh, worry about conversion factor actually conversion factor will come to your calculation automatically but let me show you this one in equal 2.5 per centimeter if you take centimeter as a numerator then you have to take inch as a denominator then you know that conversion factor is always equal to one then you have to write the number associated with centimeter that is we are getting here 2.54 centimeter and with inch we have one look at here we can take opposite of this right one inch divided by 2.54 centimeter equal to one we are just taking opposite of this one inch this is inch right this is in by 2.5 per centimeter actually this uh, conversion factor will come to our calculation automatically and you can also write a two conversion factor from here but you don't need to write because already i have shown you two example here so let me delete this okay in the third step what will i do first step look at here i will write the problem 160 centimeter i can rewrite this 160 divided by 1 centimeter times 1 that is i can express as a fraction and this one for uh, conversion factor you can take any any time but you can take any time this one right according to a need I am just writing one okay so what will you do you would like to cancel this centimeter because your target is to convert your target is feet so let me if you want to cancel this centimeter then what will you do 160 you have to one centimeter times you have to take a fraction right fraction so to cancel this centimeter you have to write centimeter as a denominator so, so that you can easily cancel this centimeter this centimeter with centimeter you have the relationship of inch from this equivalence right inch one inch equal to 
2.54 centimeter okay now you have been able to uh, to con convert it centimeter to inch now you need to cancel this inch so you have to take another uh, another uh, conversion factor so to cancel inch you have to write here inch and with inch you have the relationship of feet that is ft one feet equal to 12 inch that is with feet you have the number one associated with inch you have the number 12 associated so this inch this inch will cancel each other and you are getting 160 160 then 160 feet divided by 2.54 times 12 2.54 times 12 that is what well, that is uh, you are getting here 2. 2. 5.25 5.25 feet right that is 160 centimeter equal to 5.25 feet after rounding I hope believe and expect that you have understood what I want to say to you. Let me give you some magic point, right? Okay. From this diagram, you know that yard is greater than feet, feet is greater than inch, and inch is greater than centimeter. By using this diagram, you can change any of this unit, right? So this is a magic diagram, right? So look at here you have here centimeter and with centimeter you have the relationship of meter kilometer even millimeter with centimeter you have the relationship of meter kilometer millimeter so if you memorize this diagram then your uh, ability will increase too much right look at here you can connect this diagram with centimeter and you can connect this diagram with centimeter. That is, with centimeter you can change yard feet inch and with centimeter you can uh, change uh, meter, millimeter, kilometer, etc. And with these two diagram you can convert millimeter to yard, right? Easily, easily. Let me help you to memorize this diagram. I hope this, this diagram is very familiar to you. Let me show you this diagram. You know that kilometer is greater than meter, meter is greater than centimeter, and centimeter is greater than millimeter. Look at here, uh, one kilometer equal to 1000 meter. Then you have to deduct one zero. One meter equal to 100 centimeter. Okay, we are just uh, reducing one zero from every step. And then one centimeter equal to you have to reduce one to the 10 millimeter right okay and look at here with if you want to come from millimeter to centimeter then you have to multiply you, you millimeter to centimeter that is one millimeter equal to 1 by 10 centimeter just we are taking just we are taking opposite uh, of this 10 right opposite of 10 1 by 10 and if you come to uh, centimeter to meter then you have to take opposite of this that is 1 centimeter equal to 1 by 100 meter and then uh, you you have to if you want to come meter to kilometer then you have to uh, take you you have to take opposite of this that is 1 meter equal to 1 by 1000 kilometer i think you will be now able to convert centimeter to yard right centimeter to yard or even millimeter to uh, feet easily right so thank you for being this video be well